These guys are all dressed oh, like they're all dressed wearing jean jackets. So cute. I'm wearing one too. The odd one out. <laughs> Why? Why is that? Why didn't you want to wear one with us? Huh? I don't know. <gasps> oh, exciting. Oh, it's exciting. Oh, I love it. It's oh, all so nice. Watch me touch stuff and then it goes falling. Oh, yes, this is a cute. They're cute too. Don't go by the door because it will the alarm will go off. Stay over here with it. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't turn on. It doesn't turn on. That's so cute. That is actually really cute. Yeah. It just goes around the tree, right? Mm -hmm. Mom, look at this. Mm -hmm. Oh, careful, dude. Yeah, but it's breakable, so you should not. Some globes. This is actually kind of cute. Look at this. Is look at oh, you. you have to go step over here. Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you these are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh And I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Oh oh La da 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 oh oh La da 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 oh oh La da 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 Making our Christmas memories I've been wrapping presents for you This is Christmas Eve too I've been hanging marbles in the tree And I've lit my house with Christmas lights So you should come back home to me no, <laughs> this is like so hard. Well, I can't. Like you're sitting on Oh wow, <laughs> as it should feel. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> oh, the color. This is nice, actually. This is, that is nice. This is nice. This could go well with our couch, right? But then the theme changes. Like. Okay, we're immediately going this way. Oh, look at the tree. Oh, so cute. Lovely. <sighs> Lovely. We made it. <laughs> 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 we're doing the asylum present. Yes, too. Bone alone. <laughs> if you guys, there's some crazy asylum presents movies. This company that makes all these weird, wacky movies. <laughs> <laughs> and they make this weird spit off of Home Alone that's like a dog and it's called Bone Alone. And the dog is the narrator and it's hilarious. And they left them at home. That's not really good. <laughs> this, this, it's this? on YouTube. I feel Find it. <laughs> this is like a spin off of Guess Who? Who's there? <laughs> Very funny. Huh, let's see. Music? I 
I saw a fire truck just the other day. I heard the so siren that came my here. way. I ran down the driveway so I could see. I saw the fireman smile and wave at me. <laughs> so I'm in search. This year we we're thinking of doing like a pinkish theme inside of the living room, inside the cash, what do you call it? The family room? Oh, you can. <laughs> um, but it's very different than anything we've ever done before. So we, when we just looked in home sense, we didn't find anything, which was kind of frustrating. We found like the pink balls, but we didn't want to stick to that. So we, um, I found them and I was walking around with them and I'm like, if I found like pillows or matching things to go with it, then I would go, I would kind of choose them, but I really didn't see anything. So I just kind of left them behind. So I'm kind of starting off at scratch, but I think, I feel like, I feel like what I really need to do is to get out my own decor and see what I have and what I, what I really, um, what I want to add. I just figured if I did it this way, I'll stick to it because I know myself. If I wait until, if I go ahead and just take out what I have, I'll probably just stick with it because, you know, I'm a, <laughs> I like to save at heart. So we'll see. Anyways, I'm trying to look and check out what's in Canadian Tire because I was told that they have a lot of stuff in here, which they really do. They're just kind of all over the place. Ooh, look at this section over that here. That is cool. Okay. That is a cool one right there. I like the small Christmas tree. Yeah, it's, it's giving me cute. like a Charlie Brown Christmas tree. They have here, they have a lot. They have a nice little sale going on right now, which I did not expect. This is sort of cute, Mom. It would be nice to replace our wreath at the, at the door, huh? How much are these? 79. It's very classic, but it's huge and heavy. Like for the holiday season, we want to replace the hook because the one that we have right now, it's just old and it has like a, it's very particular. It has like a image on it and we just want like a plain classy looking one. Like simplicity. Mom, this, we should get this one. <laughs> no, this we've done something. No, Christmas. No, it's Christmas slapping you in the face. <laughs> Pretty <How>? much. <laughs> it's no. like every single color. Like very, very vibrant. Oh, I love Christmas. That's what I feel like when I see that. Because you have to be bold. See? But um, we've I gone. We've I actually. We've done it. that it's before. Like a huge Christmas ornament. We've, yeah. That yeah. sounds mean. Don't take offense. To no. <laughs> <laughs> we mean that in a good way. <laughs> Okay, we said we're meaning you go all out. Okay, no, yeah, <laughs> true. Imaginable. <laughs> I hate Christmas. <laughs> I'm joking. Oh, look. Oh, no, this is very cute, though. This is cute. Look, I like. Look, we could put this on the other tree, girl. On the white tree, girl. Look at this. This is adorable. I like that this. Really that would be different to switch it up. That's not a good, that's not a bad price. No, right? what do you think of, of that? In, Instead of the one we have at the door, or even this. That one's cute. Do you really want to see a lot of green? I do sort of want to see the circle though. Why is it bunny? Yeah. But I do like, I love how it's frosty. Mm -hmm. I think it looks perfect though. I wonder if you could ever, like, would you ever switch this and hang this over the mantle? I don't know. Oh, wait, no, right? oh it has this some cute like little that. decors. I love lanterns, but. I feel like we already have a big one. We already have one that's like this. Right. Oh look, this is ours. We have this thing at home every year and I never know what to do with it. And I'm look I'm actually thinking of parting with it. Oh look. Ooh, it would be Christmas yeah. Huh? That's considered Christmas -y? Yeah, I bought it at Christmas time. Ooh, look at these. Oh. Maybe we can put some of these lights in our library which one? Oh, those are really cute right yeah those are really cute for the oh, other section that like is for the so dining room cute. that's cute to small me thing, honey. that is adorable i like, this one. I like that you could paint that uh, yeah we need a mat for our front door but i don't know which one to get given that i'm not quite sure of the theme look at this one brie i don't want poinsettias though I don't want poinsettias. No. no yeah, I think this one's gotta go. Yeah. Oh, let's see. Next no, one. Mom. It's okay. Yeah. Gabrielle is saying we should get this one, but does this match the theme? Does it have to match the theme? 
I don't know, like, do you want to or not? Really? And then there's that one. I feel like the one that we I feel like the one that we like is definitely gingerbread theme, but <laughs> I don't feel like our theme is gingerbread. <laughs> Maybe because it's not. I said, you ever that moment where you're smelling something in a store and then your face touches it by accident? <laughs> part, a small part of you just dies inside. <laughs> that just happens. I can't. Now my chin is like hyper focused right now. <laughs> but I will no, it's, it's itching. What? This doesn't smell like Christmas. It oh, smells it does. Like lemon. It smells good. No, it doesn't no, smell like lemon. It happened again. <laughs> I can't. I can't. The cheese is not the day. It doesn't smell like lemon. Yeah, it, it smells, smells like, like lemon. It yeah. smells like. Oh, so much to see. Right. Oh, they have these cute little. What are these hooks? Please. Yeah. Please. See, they had a lot of balls again down there, but they didn't have any pink. No, I feel like. Oh my gosh. Really, rose gold. Yeah, they have a lot of gold ornaments at this <laughs> store, <laughs> but definitely not seeing a whole lot of pink. Look, mom. We have stuff like this from last year. We do. We have that color. It. Look, mm -hmm. that's pretty cute. Twas the night before Christmas. That's like a cool little book bookmark. Oh, I mean book <laughs> <laughs> book ornament. Look, a piano. Or so, guys, it has been a number of days since it's not the next day, but it's the day after that since I took you guys along with Home Sense. When I'm in there, I kind of have to, um, I kind of have to just film b-rolls because they're always playing music and they're definitely copyright so there's just no point in that um while i was in there one thing i noticed is that i don't think they have all their christmas stuff out so right now it's what november the 20th and i think they're just i don't know what it is but i feel like they're behind this year usually they're ahead and when i go in there all the things and sometimes i feel like i'm late this year i feel like i'm early that was a little bit odd for me um however when i went in there i really kind of came out with nothing so <laughs> that was uh, a big bust because the girls and i had this idea of coming up with like a pinkish theme for one room um for maybe like the family room but we're just not sure and we couldn't find like proper things to complement it while i see a lot of youtubers do it like trying the pink theme even though this year it just seems that everyone is going for traditional um decor and stuff like that i've seen a lot of people with pink themes but i never see the pink stuff so i think that's probably a part of it because everyone's doing the whole traditional thing this year i feel like i'm not seeing a lot of pink so i'm like you know what i'm not gonna go ahead and just get these balls even though i could have gotten them and returned them so I did go ahead and I made another stop at Canadian Tire and I found a few things and I ended up finding one thing there um, which is this garland. I like this because it's just more flexible. All the garlands that I've had the previous years are much thicker so they don't move in the way that I want them to and I kind of want one to put around my big front mirror as well as my, um, I have a huge mirror at the front. I'm trying to find ones to decorate over there because I actually have never decorated over that area before. So this looked the part. They did have a sale when I went. I didn't even know that. So that, that was a pleasant surprise. I think this one was like 40 bucks. So long story short, I went back today. Today was swimming day. I took the kids to swimming and then I came back and stopped by another Canadian tire because the one that I picked up, this was the last one. So I went to another one out of my area and they did not have anything like this they had all the things but nothing like this and none of what they had i liked long story short your girl ran into home sense as well i went into another home sense so i did go in the home sense the time the day before which is where i didn't get anything i went to another home sense again another one that's actually beside the other canadian tire and i did grab this other piece of garland and as you can see, these ones do have like this thicker rope stuff, but they just have like this nice vine, like and it's soft and it's flexible. This is from the Martha Stewart collection. And this one was, all I know is it was on sale for $40. Oh, it's right there. It was on sale for $40. So that was that. And then I also picked up, I ended up picking up a bunch of other things. I'll show you. I picked up a blanket, a throw as well as two pillows to complement it because I think the pink theme for me is kind of out the window at this point and we're just gonna stick with probably white 
um this year also i got rid of a lot of my blankets i donated a bunch of them and then there were some they just had this weird smell so i had to throw those out and I, because i had them in one of those like sealed bags that you store your stuff in <laughs> i don't know what happened yeah you guys let me know if you've ever experienced that if you from storing things like in a like a container bag and you find that it just stinks after i don't know what that was what, what was up with that because i always wash all my stuff before i pack them away anyways so i don't know so i threw those out and i basically have to replace all my blankets for christmas so I'm gonna show you go. The, I'm gonna show you guys those too. But I forgot that I also did get these in Canadian Tire. I got these cute little lights. Ooh, these are for um, our library. I think I was trying to explain to you guys that Charlotte and I are doing a big reno basically downstairs. I say it like we own the house together, but her and I are transforming downstairs because the area, the one room was. The kids playroom and the other room was basically like a rec room slash playroom but we if you guys don't know we're big readers so we had our library outside and it just wasn't making sense so we swapped the kids playroom and created our own library and it's coming together fairly nicely I'll give you guys a little pan don't be alarmed when you see all the books everywhere because there's a lot of books this has been our secret project that we've been working on for a minute now and and it's coming together I, I ordered a second chair for the room from Wayfair it's coming it's like really really cute love it and it should be here I think in a matter of like two days so I'm so excited about that and we're just gonna we're just like beyond excited anyways that's what these things are for this one actually is for Zoe's room she liked this one this one lights up and it's a star can you guys see it it's like little stars and the other one lights up like little little candy canes so we do plan on putting this inside of the room downstairs <laughs> see me ooh, ooh. so another thing that i got are these two pillows they're like super fluffy and so adorable like so they're so soft I really like plush pillows and I do like for them to feel super soft as well. So I got two of those. I also had ordered um, some burgundy pillow covers because I already have pillow. I already have a lot of pillows, but I will definitely need some covers to, to kind of create a theme. So those are to come tomorrow. And then I also got this nice blanket. It's this nice throw. Homesense had a few throws on sale in their clearance department. They also had a lot for sale just regularly. And I was able to find this one. This one was for $24. And it was like perfect along the lines of what I want. I'm still trying to think if I want to do the little pink theme. I'm not sure over in my sitting room against this like bluish grayish sofa. Still trying to figure it out. But if that doesn't work out, I can always do this. Like I have two living rooms to kind of dress up so i'm excited so i think i also showed you guys that i had gone to the dollar store and i found these red little cushions they're very casual and comfy they might end up just going down in the basement because i was gonna use them up here but we'll see i will see i i'm just excited i'm just waiting for babes to, to come home to take down my bins my christmas bins because he is he was away on a work trip and he'll be back by the time you guys see this so i can decide what i'm doing with these and just decide in general what i'm gonna do with like my home decor stuff i'm excited but it's just things are so high up i can't reach any of it i also had bought this little house because one of my favorite things that i love decorative wise for the holidays are like um i just love little houses <laughs> little lit houses this is just so cute so this is gonna go on one of our bookshelves downstairs i can't wait i'm gonna be showing i'm gonna we're gonna be decorating down there too so you guys can see the final product when it comes together very very excited um like i said i'm not going all out oh while i'm at it i might as well give you guys a quick little glimpse of what of, of an item that i actually think would make like a really good 
Christmas or birthday gift. Okay, that area's a little wet. Let me wipe it up quick. There's always something happening in this house. It wet. So let me prop you guys up to show it to you properly because I really, really like this. That's why I ended up getting two. Okay guys, so what I'm showing you is this Bible case. It's this Bible travel case slash cute little purse. Okay, this is just a Bible case, but it looks like a purse. Like what I love about it is that this one actually currently has um, Charlotte's Bible in it because I got that one for her and I got this one for me. So we like to take notes at church and we like to bring little notebooks as well as highlight and those types of things. So it's conducive for us to have like something that can secure <laughs> secure our stuff because right now my bible just has like i'm trying to squish some highlighters in there and there's barely enough room and sometimes we're left carrying like an external like just a whole other bag outside of our bibles just to carry some of the basic things that we need so i found this on amazon so it has this front pocket which is just so it has this front pocket which is storage it does come with this mesh part as well to like store whatever you want in there then there's a the main inside part this part right here is kind of like if you want to carry like your tablet or your credit cards because i mean it is basically like a purse if you're traveling and you don't want to carry anything else that's basically what it is you can put your phone in here other books in here um this section is the section where you're probably going to store like all your writing utensils and such then the, we have the other side, same difference. You can put markers, highlighters, more storage, more storage, and just like, I don't know, if you wanna store your Bible in like in the form of a flap so you can open it, that's also great. Some people just store their Bibles in here or underneath this, or they just lay, lay it in there, and it also has, you know, the little ribbon for it. And of course, another back pocket. And my favorite thing is that you can just carry it to go. I thought I'd share that with you guys. You're looking for a gift idea for someone who you know, maybe in search of a Bible, but you know, having a case for it would be ideal. And just, um, yeah, if, if you yourself have been on the hunt for a Bible case, definitely check it out. I'll leave a link in the description box for you guys to check it out because honestly, I'm really, really liking it. I can't wait. I, Charlotte and I are going to sit down and kind of like fix our Bibles together um, and put our things in it, like all of our highlighters and our pencils and pens and all that jazz. So I'm excited for that, but definitely want to share that with you.